Good morning everybody and welcome to Living Uniquely You and myself Sharon Brown. I hope you are all doing well on this um, Friday morning. I'm coming in today to help you unhook from the 3D matrix. So, so the fear, the conditioning, there's a lot of it going on at the moment, especially in the media and it's bringing up an awful lot of fear and anxiety in everyone, especially this time of year when people want to spend their time with their loved ones. So I'm going to help you unhook from that energy and then fully helping you to anchor in to that beautiful, beautiful 5D energy. So into the 5D matrix of love, joy, happiness. And just sorry, my camera's a bit on the wobbly side. I'm just trying to fix it. Um, so it's getting out of the head and dropping into the heart and really just allowing yourself to see your beautiful self and really letting go of all the crap that we're being told you can't do this you can't do that you need to have this you need to have that to go there not to do to do to do to do i could go on and on and on and on and on but we're not here to to do that what we are here to do is just be our true divine self and allowing our light to shine because we have come here with missions with a mission for our soul to expand to our level and we have come to help a lot of other people so we are being called forward as way showers light workers to hold the light as we go through this darkness at this moment in time so it's really allowing you to come into you and to see yourself this is why we are being pushed and pushed and pushed and pushed and pushed constantly but it's and it's like life lessons are literally being thrown at us left right and center especially this year we've had a lot of life lessons um, <clears throat> and that's just for us to work through it and to see <clears throat> and to see our, ourselves and where we need to we need to go through the lesson so we can help others because unless we've gone through it, we can't help somebody else because as they say, unless you know, don't judge me unless you've walked in my shoes. That is exactly, we cannot judge anyone whether, none of us are perfect. That's the way I look at it. I'm not perfect. We all make mistakes. So it's just allowing ourselves to see that shadow side of ourselves working on that shadow side of ourselves and then allowing our light to be shine and allowing ourselves to help other people because we are being called to help a lot of people but when we're stuck in that 3d matrix we get into all the media stuff and we get into our head and we can get drawn into it without actually even realizing that we're getting drawn into it so now it's literally unhooking from it and just allowing ourselves to come in into our own little lane and just staying in our own lane so I'm going to ask you to take a deep breath in. So just calling all your energy back. <coughs> Sorry. From people, places, situations, time and space. All the way back through that divine filter of pure love and light. Because we only want your energy back all the way back. all the way back through that divine filter of pure love and light just unhooking we don't need them so just allowing yourself to come fully fully back through that divine filter of pure love and light and breathe out take another deep breath in and allowing your energy to fully, fully drop into you. So allowing you drop in to you. And breathe out. Take another deep breath in. Acknowledge how you're feeling, not wanting to change anything. And breathe out. Bring your awareness to your heart and as you bring your awareness to your heart, visualise 
four big golden roots were being given today. Right down into your solar plex, your sacral chakra, your roots, your hips, your legs, your feet, the floor. Right down into your earth star chakra and into the core of Mother Earth. Feeling your energy and Mother Earth's energy combining as one. And feeling this energy move up into your earth star chakra. Pulling your earth star chakra all the way down, down, down. Right down into the centre of the crystalline grid, all the way down, allowing you to drop another two feet down. The higher we go up, the deeper we need to go into Mother Earth. So we're dropping another two feet down. Just feeling yourself drop. Surrender to it. All the way down into your new rightful place. Fully, fully anchoring your energy into this is your rightful place on this earth nobody else's feeling your roots multiply and fully wrapping around the crystalline grid fully anchoring you in feeling the second part of the grid to come up to fully seal in your earth star chakra feeling this energy move up into your feet your root and your heart doing a 360 degree around your heart chakra Calling in the energy from source, pure, unconditional love of the highest vibration. Dropping right down into your stellar gateway, clearing anything that's stopping you from having divine connection. Into the crown, or sorry, into your soul star chakra so you can see, sense and feel your true soul's path and allowing that to fully illuminate in front of you. Into your causal chakra so your intuition can be fully heightened. Into the crown of your head so you can think more clearly. Into your third eye so you can see more clearly. Into your ear chakra so you can hear divine guidance. Into your throat chakra so you can speak your truth with pure love and light. Into the higher heart, connecting into that universal energy of 5D and allowing you to fully anchor that within your life and body. Into your heart so you can see you, you can love you, you can see your beauty inside Into your solar plex so you can unleash your true divine masculine energies, allowing them to fully balance within the body and fully accepting yourself no matter what. Into your navel chakra so you can connect into that universal energy of oneness, oneness to all, connection to all. And allowing you to fully anchor that within Into your solar plex, sorry, into your sacral chakra so you can unleash your true divine feminine energies, allowing them to fully balance within the body and remembering and reawakening your true gifts and talents, who you truly are. Into your root chakra so you can bring in the abundance of life and all life has to offer. Into your hips, your legs and your feet so you can take any necessary steps forward right down into your earth star chakra and into the core of Mother Earth. Feeling this energy move all the way up into your feet, your root and your heart. Doing a 360 degree around your heart chakra. Feeling your energy, Mother Earth's energy and Father Sky's energy combining as one and feeling this energy move to every part of your body every part of your being dropping right down into that stillness into that oneness where nobody needs anything from you nobody wants anything from you this is your time and your space now just being shown the hooks there's four major hooks in our body 
just literally after showing them to me. <clears throat> I'll, and there's loads of other little hooks and energy ties to the 3D matrix. But there's one in our crown, okay? Stop us from free thinking. So I'm just going to ask the, the galactic guides to come in and clear and unhook each individual person from all time and space, backwards and forwards, multidimensionally to all timelines to be cleared on all levels, all layers, all dimensions, to be unhooked from the 3D matrix within the crown chakra. And I see a man and a katayata so say a man and a kalena no kasi a patata ta si a pata nie patada na nie patad nie patad yeo chapa si a patu ye ye si a. Now there's one in the heart chakra. Unhooking. It's actually in between. Be in the higher heart and the heart. So it's unhooking the soul from the 3D matrix. To be cleared on all levels, all layers, all dimensions, past, present and future lifetimes. To unhook, unrelease and clear the 3D matrix out of the higher heart and the heart. Now we're dropping down into the solar plex and we're releasing the hook from the solar plex of free will. Clearing all conditionings to be cancer cleared, anything hidden or unhidden, anything seen or unseen. To be cleared on all levels, all layers, all dimensions, past, present and future lifetimes. Multidimensionally, backwards and forwards. Unhooking, clearing the unhooking, clearing the 3D matrix. Now we have one in the sacral chakra. Stopping our creativity, our willpower, our divine spark. So unhooking, releasing from this 3D matrix. Cancel, clear, delete, destroy from all time and space, backwards and forwards, multidimensionally, to all timelines to be cleared on all levels. All layers, all dimensions, past, present and future. Lifetimes. Nya maya yo ya ya maya nya 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 si apataya ye chompoto mo ye apasi chiapale ko konoka sana maya na na kataya na katasi apatasu chiapale na na na. Now I'm going to <clears throat> unhook the rest of the all the small little hooks. That are holding us in this 3D matrix to be cancer clear, delete, sorry from all time and space, backwards and forwards, multi-dimensionally, to all timelines to be cleared on all levels, all layers, all dimensions, past, present, and future lifetimes. <laughs> Oh, 
ce pasi, ce anana cu ei. Nia mai, nia mai, nia mai, nia mai. Pasule le mati, a pasu, ce a pa pa pa. Che si a pa. No si a pa 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 sa i a pa le i che cone si a pa ta se e i che. So just allowing yourself just to come back in. Just allowing the energies to fully settle. Okay, a pasuna ya patana nakalena na sama makatayana. I'm going to just fully anchor in you into that 5D matrix, whatever is right for you, whatever is your reality. I can just feel us being flooded with beautiful high vibrational rainbow sparkly energy Chia pa si a ma, kuno si a pa ta ta si, chia pa la na na ka si a ma na ka. Nia ya ya ma 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 ya Okay, asana mata le na no ko su ye ye pa ta la la la. Si a ma na na su ye ye pa sa na ma ya ta te i si a pa. Ko no sa na ma ya na na si a pa ta le 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 no so no mo ye ye pa ta na na ka. Ko no se ya pa sa na ma ka te ye ye pa su le le ma na na ka te ya ma na na na. Si che ya pa 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 pa. Just feeling your chakras been spinning three times to the right. Kunosa maya ya na na, so ya ya na na, se ya na na na. Three times left. Kunosa mata se ya pata na na kate se i so ya pe ya na na kate se te. And three times right again. Kunosa ya pata, se ya ma na na su ye. Kunote ya pe, su te ya ta se. Kanana sonono. Te lele konote sehe yata. I'm just going to ask you to cross your hands over your knees and fully, fully anchor that energy in. Morning, Yvonne. Hi, Geraldine. Anybody else that's watching? Just slowly, slowly bring yourself back. Oh, wow, that was something else. That's all I'd say. That was something else. So just allowing yourself to slowly, slowly come back. That was so powerful. Wow. I could see the hooks. I could literally see the hooks. Wow. Okay, so I'm just going to pull you. I thought I was bringing in the drum, which I had the drum here ready and all. But obviously I wasn't. I had some, I had something else in mind for me this morning. Hope you are all okay after that. I'm going to pull the Wisdom of Change card. And an animal, I could feel my um two beautiful spirit animal guides stepping forward during that just to protect me, my two beautiful um wolves. Well, that's all I'll say as well. Hmm. So I'm just going to pull an animal card. What animal we need for the weekend. I actually thought I was bringing in the new moon energy. <laughs> so I thought. Oh my God, the wolf, the pathfinder. Exactly what we are after doing today. My God, literally stepping fully, fully out onto our path. Allowing ourselves to see our true self. 
allowing ourselves to be ourselves. The beautiful, beautiful wolf. Speak our truth. So magical. Release the past and start a new journey. You are a teacher to help others find their way. There will be ch challenges, but you, your soul is strong. Preservation is your secret power. You have a love that endures. So that's the beautiful wolf. His eyes are speaking to me, literally speaking to me as I look at that. And I know exactly what that card means so much to me. Because I know there's something unfolding new for me in the new year. And I'm going um, to a higher, higher thing. So it's about mentoring people along their path and allowing their souls to sing. That's my galactic soul blueprint. And a wisdom of change. A wisdom of change. And then, of course, I'm stepping out to do my first retreat up the north, which I am so excited for on the 21st of January, which is very little places left, guys. So if you are interested in going, please DM me because I think there's only about five places left. I'll have to go back and check. I'm not 100% sure. Brand new. Look at that. And literally we are on, oh, after unhooking from the 3D matrix. So we are all squeaky clean in that 5D energy. You have been feeling ill uh, at ease of late, wondering if you are enough and feeling that others are somehow better placed to take delivery of, of your heart's desire. This card is here to, here to remind you that there is no competition for who you are. You are enough. Your desires are no mistake. Your uniqueness is whole and complete. The perfect vehicle for you to serve the people who need you. You are your debt. You are your destiny in every moment. Continue to take inspired action towards your goals and never, ever give up. Do you hear that? Never, ever give up. You are everything you need. That's exactly what we needed to hear today. Guys, have a magical new moon. No, sorry, full moon tomorrow night. In, in Virgo, I think it is. Sorry, but I was bringing in that energies, but obviously they had something very different for me to do. So we obviously need to unhook from that 3D matrix. Have a magical weekend. Remember, guys, keep yourself hydrated, grounded. You are the most important person in your life and keep yourself in your own lane. Guys, have a magical weekend and I will talk to you all again on Monday. Take care, guys. Bye.